You know, one of the things that I've been sensing, it's like you, you use their face down. One of the things that I've been sensing is that we're at a time where God is going to take us into a face-to-face -face encounter. And uh, part of this, um, this year that we're coming into, um, for those of you who may not be familiar with this, it's a pay and bait year. Now, the thing is this, the, the pay is the face. You know, Jacob was at Peniel, the and he met God face to face. And um, also Moses um, knew what it was to meet God face to face. But also there was the bait, which is the Bethel, which he was a place of revelation. So I feel that God is wanting to take us into a, a hidden place. Because if you, you look at the letter of the pay, it has a hidden bait in it, which means there's a hidden dwelling place. Mm. There's a hidden house. That God wants to take you into. Now, Matthias, you have some other language for that as well. When you talk about being face down yeah. in the presence of the Father, yeah. and I want you to explain some of that, because um, and just to just to um, connect with some things that you say. Jesus was alone in the garden, mm -hmm. dealing face to face with his Father, yeah. but also the enemy. Mm -hmm. was the one who was trying to actually destroy him. Yeah. And he was actually um, producing, or you said with Moses, mm -hmm. Pharaoh actually <laughs> made provision for him. Yeah. So just explain some of that, because I felt that there was some real anointing yeah. upon that, of being face down, yeah. and coming into this season where we're going to be face to face, in God's hidden place, and that is not the wilderness, I believe he's taken us into the house of Revelation. Just yeah, that's so beautiful what you say, it's the house of, 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 of Revelation. Well, I think like, it's so beautiful when you're face to face with the Father, mm. you are away from the opinion of other people. A lot of, yeah. There's a lot of stuff going on right now in the church, even Christians fighting with each other about yeah. all different subjects, yes. I, I even know what to mention yeah. it. But you know, so, so I think in this time, when there is so much confusion going on around about so many subjects, even in church. Yeah. I do believe when we are face to face with the Lord, is we are away, alone with the Lord, away from opinions. Mm. We are away from uh, the, the stuff people are saying. So I, I, I so believe that in this time, when you're face to face with the Father, we start to realize who we are in Christ. Amen. I, I do believe that it's, it's the deep cries out to deep. That's yes. what's happening right now. Yes. And it's also when you're face to face with the Father, the enemy is not able to touch you. You, yeah. you are away even from uh, the, the head trash, the enemy is yes. trying you know, to, to say to us. Yeah. Uh, it's also a, a, really a time right now that the Lord is revealing who you really are. Yeah. Because there's a Kairos moment right now happening. Yeah. And there's something what God has spoken inside of the people, what the Lord wants to reveal in this time. And it's huge. It's big. It has to do with revival. Yeah. It has to do with a supernatural Come harvest. On. It has Come to do on. with calling. Come on. And, and you know, the enemy is shaking. Yeah. That's the reason he's yeah. going around so with force right now. Splitting families, yes. splitting churches, bringing division because he knows that the time has come that Christians all around the world starts to realize what God put deep inside of them. Yeah. So when you're face to face, you're away from all the distraction. Come on. Like, and and I, I believe stuff. this is the season we have to be face yeah. to face with the Father.